and gentlemen, the following tag team contest is scheduled for one fall. Coming down the aisle. WWE's most exciting teams ready to go here tonight in tag team action. But I can tell you that the entire tag team division has eyes on this match right now. That's how big this one is. Okay. 
surefire first ballot Hall of Famer. Everything he's created in the ring and out. This match is underway, and whether anyone likes it or not, Stephanie McMahon is going to show us what she can do. In fact, I think when the fans sound off in disgust, it motivates her to be even more combative. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Snapmare. Oh, and the rolling neck snap. Elbow finds its mark. She's starting to take a beating, but I'd be surprised if she doesn't find a way back in control of this thing. The good news is, oh. here comes Stephanie McMahon. It doesn't look like she's going to get her to tap here. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael. Delivered with force. She's starting to feel the pressure. You can see her partner wants to get tagged in here. I don't know how much longer she can go on absorbing all this punishment. She needs to find a way to make it to her corner and make the tag. Talk about great tag teams. We can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoe, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Now it's Lesnar taking some punishment. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, the New Day, the Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus. I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Rhodes, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE the cover. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. 
I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage, and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots. But I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record-setting 483 days. Brock Lesnar with the tag. Oh, man, that hurt the back. Spine rattling. Triple H showing a lot of heart here. But how can he turn this around in his favor? His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. If I'm his partner, I'm furious right now. There's no reason why he shouldn't have made a tag by now. Well, I'm sure he saw things going differently for him here tonight, but that clearly isn't the case, unfortunately for him. Oof! Wow, talk about knowing where you're at at all times! What a throw! You guys know what I like most about Brock Lesnar? It's that he lets his actions in the ring do the talking for him. I wish a lot more people would employ that strategy. Irish whip! Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. Some superstars love to talk the talk, as Corey was alluding to. But with Brock Lesnar, it's as if there's no time for talking. He just wants to get in there, get the job done, and leave. Just like his shirt says, eat, sleep, conquer, repeat. Destruction just comes naturally for the Beast Incarnate. Uh-oh, suplex! Triple H can't be feeling good right now. Unless this thing turns around here, this tag team match is all but over. Unless he has no interest in walking away with the winner's end of the purse, he needs to make a tag immediately. At this point, he has to be thinking to himself, what do I have to do to get back in this thing? Oh, he's such a tough target. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. Gotta get back in the ring. We might just have a count out on our hands, Cole. Bringing it back into the ring. Lesnar drives him down, but Cole's not finished. No, not at all. Lesnar again with the power. Another power bomb. But he's running on feet. The shoulders are down. an impressive tag team victory. How about another look at... Here are your winners. And Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar puts the finishing touches on this one for the win. Michael, never in my wildest dreams that I think these two would work so well together. The arena is still buzzing over that great match.